everybody, it's Anita Foster with the Arlington ISD on a very exciting day for our school district. We had six large trailers professionally equipped to carry band equipment for our award-winning bands. And I'm joined here today with students from all of our different schools, but with you in particular, tell me your name and what school you're with. My name is Noah and I go to uh, Bowie, uh, Bowie High School. So you uh, were saying earlier that you were really excited I for am. these trailers. What does it mean for you guys in the band? Um, it's going to help a lot with transporting all of our instruments and our props. And, you know, we get new props and things like that. It's going to help organizing and make sure that we're on time to all of our events and we have the most utmost uh, excellence in all of our performances. Now Noah, what instrument do you play? I play tuba, but I'm also a drum major. Okay, so tuba, that's uh -huh. a large instrument Very, to carry, uh -huh. so you really appreciate it. I surely do, it's going to help a lot. Well, we're thrilled. Your trailer looks amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, you guys are all award-winning musicians. So does this help you to be a better musician? Very much so. It's going to really uh, motivate us on the field and off the field because now we don't have to worry about getting a truck and stressing over the transportation and logistics and things because it's all there for us and there's nothing to worry about anymore. And I've heard that from uh, some other folks that said, you know, parents would throw the instruments in the back of trucks or, you know, a makeshift trailers trying to get them to performances. Not everything would show up at the same time. <laughs> yeah, no more worries about that. Well, this is wonderful. Congratulations to you, you and all of your classmates. Thank you. Okay, we're going to go on down because we have lots of other band students here. Come on down. How are you? Good. So you're excited as well about these yes. trailers, right? So tell us your name and what school you're with. Um, I'm Aditi. I go to Lamar High School and I play the trumpet. I am the band president. Oh, you're the band president. Fantastic. What does it mean for you to, to see this happen today? I think it would be easier for like, the next like people in band to like load and like unload and I know it takes a long time and they always have to get other sections to help them so I think this will help them make it faster. Well congratulations to all of you. Have you looked inside the trailer yet? I know y'all are looking forward to that yes. right? So I understand there's compartments for everything and, and uh, everything will have a place. Yes. It's wonderful. Congratulations. Thank you. Good luck with the rest of your school right, year. You. Okay, and then of course we have the Sam Houston, the Texan band, right over here. How are y'all today? Good, how are you? Well, tell me your name. My name is Jacqueline. Okay, how excited are you? Uh, I'm pretty excited. It's so, really cool. how did you guys get your instruments around before? Um, we they usually rented out this big. Uh, I don't know what it's called. They rented out something for the bigger instruments, the percussion instruments, and everybody else had to take their instruments. With them. So maybe they all got to the field on time. Maybe they didn't. Uh, there was only one occasion. I think we were really lucky that every single time the instruments got there on time. Yes. But there's only one occasion. <laughs> But this will make it a lot easier, oh, yeah, right? For sure. Oh, well, thank you and congratulations. This is really phenomenal. Okay, we have so much going on here today. Uh, all of the bands are represented by members of, of their teams uh, to see these trailers for the very first time. And we have some special guests with us today too. And I see them just around the corner. A couple of doctors in the house. Uh, Dr. Marcelo Cavazos, our superintendent of schools and Dr. Christopher Anderson, the head of our fine arts department. And then we have some Arlington High School uh, band folks with us. Dr. Cavazos, congratulations. Well, congratulations to all of us. And really, the beneficiaries of all of this are our young students, uh, really demonstrating the investment that Arlington has had in the arts, um, and also uh, the culmination of the 2014 bond, which is our Visual and Performing Arts Center. And we thought it would be fitting to be here with our trailers as part of our 2019 bond uh, to make sure that uh, that we connect those things because they are connected uh, in, in terms of the investment in the arts. And I'm just so proud of our students uh, as they continue to demonstrate excellence. This is just one more way that we can uh, continue to safely transport the instruments, make sure they get there on time, but also uh, really uh, demonstrating that excellence that they provide on the field and in performances all the time. Well, and I know that we all know this. The band members know this. We know it as, as uh, Arlington ISD employees. Our bands are all award-winning, and the district is nationally known for its commitment and excellence in the fine arts. Dr. Christopher Anderson leads that effort here for the Arlington ISD. Tell us about that. Award-winning, nationally recognized for the arts. Well, yeah, we've got uh, programs K through 12 that are absolutely phenomenal programs and celebrated far and wide. 
Um, but we're always pushing, up, pushing the envelope with that. We want to uh, expand the quality and we want to continue to bring that excellence to higher and higher levels. And so this particular project is just another piece of a, of a multifaceted project that's made up of lots and lots of different people uh, that, that helps to establish this excellent equipment and this first-rate experience that our kids have. Well, this is just such an exciting day. Tell me emotionally what you felt when you saw this dream actually become a reality today. Well, I mean, not to be too colloquial, but there's nothing cooler than a semi-truck. <laughs> so six of them, with all of our colors, knowing that the, the kids are going to be involved in this and seeing every school represented equally, it is just really exciting. We've been working on this for a really long time. To, so to see these things come together like this and just know, okay, we've been able to deliver this and now the excitement is watching it be utilized. Uh, we're, we're really excited about this. Ms. Walton, tell us how excited you are about today. This is just amazing. Not only are they beautiful, but they are so functional. It will make everything so much safer for us to move instruments all over wherever they need to be. The most exciting thing I'm thinking is I learned that there's solar panels on the top of these trucks that are running all the power. So it's not taking any other kind of energy except solar, which I think is really exciting. I didn't know that. That is quite fascinating, actually. I didn't know that either. What would you say to the voters for the 2019 bond? Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. This is providing all of our students, no matter which high school uh, they attend, to have uh, one of these wonderful trailers to do, uh, to support their programs, their fine arts programs, their music programs, which is so near and dear to my heart. <laughs> if you're interested in fine arts, Arlington ISD is a great district. Opportunities from kindergarten all the way through graduation. So whatever your passion is in the fine arts, we've got a place for you. You can go to our website, AISD.net, and learn about fine arts, our academic excellence, our extracurriculars, everything else that we have to offer in the Arlington ISD. For today, we're gonna wrap it up with a huge thank you to all of the voters for the 2014 bond and the 2019 bond uh, interdependently making today happen. So thank you so much. And we'll see you again very, very soon on our next Facebook Live.